Hey everyone, in this video, I will tell you about the food that you should avoid in gout and the food that may be beneficial. So let me first tell you about gout. Gout is a type of arthritis that involves sudden pain, swelling and inflammation of the joints. These symptoms occur when there is too much of uric acid in the blood. This uric acid then crystallizes and settles in the joints. If you have gout, Certain foods may trigger an attack by raising your uric acid levels. Trigger foods are commonly high in purines and when you digest purines, your body makes uric acid as a waste product. Now this is not a concern for healthy people as they efficiently remove excess uric acid from the body. But people with gout cannot efficiently remove this excess uric acid and thus a high purine diet may lead to uric acid accumulation and it causes a gout attack. Food that commonly trigger gout attack includes organ meats, red meat, seafood, alcohol and beer. They contain a moderate to high amount of purines. However, there is one exception to this rule. High purine vegetables such as asparagus and spinach do not trigger gout attacks. And fructose and sugar sweetened beverages can increase the risk of gout attacks even though they are not purine rich. Let's now discuss what food should be avoided. You should avoid high purine food. These are foods that contain more than 200 mg of purines per 100 gram or 3.5 ounces. You should also avoid high fructose foods as well as moderately high purine foods. Here are a few major high purine foods. Moderately high purine foods and high fructose foods that should be avoided. First. All organ meats and these include liver, kidneys, sweetbreads and brain. Second is game meats and the example of game meats is pheasant, veal and venison. Third is fish and some of the examples may be herring, trout, mackerel, tuna and sardines. Other seafoods like scallops, crab, shrimp and roe should also be avoided. Fifth are sugary beverages, especially fruit juices and sugary sodas. Sixth, added sugars, for example, honey, agave nectar, and high fructose corn syrup. Seventh, yeast, nutritional yeast, brewer's yeast, and other yeast supplements should also be avoided. Let's now discuss the foods that you should eat. Now, you can consume low purine foods. Foods are considered low purine when they have less than 100 mg of purines per 100 grams. Here are some low purine foods that are generally safe for people with gout. First are fruits. All fruits are generally fine for gout. And cherries may even help prevent attacks by lowering uric acid levels and reducing inflammation. Second is vegetables. Now you may consume all vegetables including potato, peas, mushroom, eggplant, and dark green leafy vegetables. Third are legumes. Legumes include lentils, beans, soya beans and tofu. So you may consume almost all the legumes. Fourth, nuts and seeds. All the nuts and seeds are fine. Fifth is whole grain. Now whole grains include for example oats, brown rice and barley. Sixth is dairy products. Now all dairy product is safe but low fat dairy product is especially beneficial. Seventh are eggs. Next, beverages. Beverages like coffee, tea and green tea. Ninth is herbs and spices. And last one, that is tenth one are plant-based oils. For example, canola, coconut, olive oil and fox oils. So you can consume all of these things and they may even be beneficial in gout. So that's all for now. I hope the video was helpful. Thank you.